Hi, my name is Greg and today I tell you about open die project metal detector Quon PRWare. A few features of this metal detector. First of all, it's open die project with open scheme and with open hex files. So everybody can repeat it, you can download the schemes, download the hex files, uh, but you should have ability and knowledge how to program a microcontroller. Clone PRWare is a pulse induction metal detector without discrimination, but it has uh, after setting for search coil and can be used with a different size of search coil. It shows good results on difficult soils, sea beaches and uh, fresh and salt water. On in basic you can build ground and underwater metal detectors. Let's look on the board. It's built on microcontroller at Mega 8A. Two other microchips TL074 and HEF4066. The other side is here. Here is connector is to connect the search coil for battery and uh, turn on off. Here is the uh, buttons to control menu, barrier plus minus and zero. And connectors for LCD and buzzer. Uh, in this scheme used LCD 6002A for 5 volts. Let's connect it so together and look to the menu. I connected the battery without button on off, so I connected here the plus, turn on, I will turn light for better and let's go on the menu, uh, the first of all is the volume control. The power of volume can be changed. The second, it's light. It's the turn light on the LCD. The next is the, the lowest level of the battery when metal detector turn off. Now it's the 10.5 volt. Round interval. This parameter is the setting of search coil. It can be auto when every time when you turn on turn on metal detector, it's auto setting for search coil. And last, it's from the previous time when uh, you turn last variant, it will be used. Uh, parameters from previous seances of work and you can choose your own parameters from 2 to 80. Round adjust. It can be adaptive, fixing or turn off. Volume raise. It depends of uh, what type of volume you raise you prefer. It can be one from eight, one from sixteen, one from thirty-two, one from four, one from two, and just one. Now let's connect it the search coil and look how it's. Uh, setting for the search coil. Now it's the turning and when it finds the best parameter oh, for this coil metal detector decided that 12 is the best ground interval. Uh, this is the zero button.
This is the bottom of change the barrier. Uh, here in LCD you can so see this parameter. The higher barrier, the low sensitive of the metal detector. But we are inside the flat and around the coil a lot of metal things. So it's not the best variant for test. But you can look how it's worked. Uh, on LCD it shows the level of battery, the level of barrier, turn on or off the light on the display, and uh, the volume level here. Uh, let's test its sensitive with my uh, test coil, 28 centimeters. But you shouldn't forget that we are inside the flat and a lot of metal around us, so it's the, not the best results. With small coin. Big coin. and gold ring. Yeah, this type of metal detector can be used for gold searching. The big advantage of this metal detector is easy of manufacture of the search coil. So it can be built from different type of wear, it's not the precise process and it, uh, it's very good because the other kind of metal detectors can't uh, work with uh, not perfect produced coil. I connected this one coil to show you how it's turning for other variants of coil. But you shouldn't forget that in this base you can build deep metal detector with the huge coils like 1 meter for 1 meter or 2 meter square coil and it uh, will have a huge power. So let's look on this, how it's turning. Look on the display. Then for this coil. Let's test it with this coil. Small coin. When it's parallel and with the edge of the coin, the different situation like with any other metal detector. And gold ring. On description to this video, I leave the link for this project from where you can download the scheme, hex files and other information to build this metal detector. And I leave the link for the store where you can buy this kit which was in my review. If you like this video, please put button like, subscribe to my channel. And uh, if you have any questions, please write the comments to this video. Goodbye.